I am crazy for egg noodles. Up next on the Trailer Park Cooking Show. <laughs> She's bringing the trailer park lifestyle to the world. Come inside, don't be shy, cause Jolene can't wait to meet ya. She's the queen of the park, she's got gossip news and lots of food to feed ya. Jolene Sugar Baker, Jolene Sugar Baker is one budget minded girl. Lots of cheap fashion is the passion at the park. The passion at the park. The passion at the park. Dropping in on neighbors is all part of Jolene's work. Jolene Sugar Baker, she's the trailer park queen. Hi there, Trailer Park fans. It's Jolene Sugar Baker, the Trailer Park Queen. And welcome to the Trailer Park Test Kitchen. And welcome to another edition of Cooking with Jolene, the Trailer Park Cooking Show, where I show you how to do it on a budget the Trailer Park way. Well, I am still crazy over Lancaster, Pennsylvania. I went up there and visited the Amish. Well, I didn't, you know, knock on the door or anything. They have markets where they sell all their good food. And I went to a family-style restaurant, and they had something called brown butter noodles. And I was like, this tastes like the most amazing spices that this, I don't know what they put on those. So I went and I bought some of their egg noodles that they make right there in the restaurant gift shop. That is such a money maker, let me tell you that. But this, this these egg noodles, we're gonna make these this great sauce that's super easy. It's a super secret uh, ingredient. It's so simple, you'll never guess what it is. But we're gonna do it right up next. Brown butter noodles, Amish style, on the Trailer Park Cooking Show. I'll be right back. Welcome back. To make my brown buttered noodles, I've got some egg noodles here, and you can find those in the grocery store pasta section. And I've got some salted water here, and you're going to follow the package directions, which are usually about 8 to 12 minutes, or follow the Amish people directions if they wrote it on the package. So let me get these started, and I'll check back with you in just a moment. Okay, once your egg noodles are done, drain them and put them in a bowl or a serving platter and set them aside. Now comes the rather easy part and it's only one ingredient that really makes this dish and it's two sticks of butter and I'm going to put that in a saucepan up on medium high heat. Now you can't step away. What we're going to do is melt this down and the secret is, and it brings out all these unusual flavors, I just don't know how it does it, is we're going to brown this butter in this saucepan. And we're going to check on it here in just a moment, and I'll show you what I mean. But I'm going to start melting this down and get it to the point where we can talk about the browning part. Okay, we've got some browning going on in our butter, and that's exactly what we want because this tastes really good. So we're going to let this keep cooking so we get more brown in it and I'll check back with you in just a moment. Okay, after several minutes on the stove top and us stirring it around, look at that dark golden and brown flecks of, well it's kind of brown butter is what it is. Actually that's all it is, but it tastes so good and We've worked the butter down, and it's okay if it's a little bit foamy, but this goes right on top of our drained noodles, and this really does really make the noodles. So let me go ahead and pour some on, and it just looks so nice on a serving platter. There we go, the nice little brown specks right up on top, and that foam will settle down in the noodles. That's all right. There we go and make sure you get all that goodness there and you can just spread it out there and it'll sizzle a little bit there we go and look at that it looks so pretty with that butter melting down in there i can't wait to try this i'll be right back Oh, 
And there you have it, my brown butter noodles. This sure was simple. It was really only one ingredient, but it took great care up on the stovetop to bring it to the actual render that we did. It got the brown specks, and this will really play some tricks on your taste buds because I thought it tasted like cinnamon and brown pepper and all sorts of things all mixed together, but it really is just butter that has been rendered down up on the stovetop. It really perks up a noodle. So let me get a little taste of this here and some of that nice brown butter up on top. It certainly will wake up your dinner. Let me get a taste. Mmm, that is very home style. Those Amish people really know how to cook. Mmm, that just tastes like so many spices, but it's just butter up on top of those noodles. Mmm, it would be good on vegetables too. I hope you get a chance to make my brown butter noodles, and if you do, send me pictures at JoleneSugarBaker at gmail.com. Don't forget to follow me all over the place. I post my travel pictures on Instagram, I'm on Facebook, and my website, JoleneSTrailerPark.com. I've got more cooking shows right around the corner. Hit that big old subscribe button. I'm so excited. Summer is right around the corner. We're going to be cooking up a storm together. I love y'all. Continue to live the trailer park way. I'll see you back real soon. Bye-bye. Slap on all your blue eyeshadow.